life. It's about the ups and downs. It's about the adversity. It's about the sad times. It's about the hard times. Former first round pick Solomon Thomas is entering his seventh season as a defensive back in the NFL, suiting up for a second year with the New York Jets. My family is really close because the one constant is that we always had each other. You know, I was born in Chicago, we moved to Australia, then moved to Connecticut, then moved to Texas. And so we're always losing friends, making new friends, but one thing that I always had was my sister. Ella always taught me that I was okay being myself. The most special bond that, you know, I feel like I could ever, ever have had. A bond that continued to grow into adulthood until tragically Ella died by suicide. How could Ella not be here? How could Ella die? Like, how could that amazing person just not, not, not be here anymore? And then, you know, it just kind of broke me, broke me to my core. I didn't know that it was this big of a problem. And I learned how much of a problem suicide and mental health is in our society. From then on out, my family and I, we decided, hey, there's something that needs to be done. That's when Solomon and his family started a nonprofit called The Defensive Line aiming to tackle suicide among youth by providing health and wellness programs and resources. I never thought I would ever do this. You know, I never thought that I'll be sitting here talking about my emotions, talking about my the worst times of my life. And for Solomon, the motivation is clear to continue efforts his sister championed and to keep her memory alive. This is one of her dreams. You know, Ella wanted to help people who were struggling with mental health because she went through it so much. I'm just Sitting here trying to try to live her live her mission, live her dream, um, keep her alive with me in every step of the way. Today, he's collaborating with an artist and the NFL's Players Association on this artwork that will be auctioned to benefit former players and their families, all in an effort to highlight our lived experience and honor our human connection. Strength doesn't come from being silent or pushing down our emotions. Strength is in vulnerability. It's in letting people know how you're doing. It's in um, connecting with those around you who are struggling. And when you do that, when you have these vulnerable moments with people, you never know how it's gonna save them or connect with them. This life is about the ups and downs. The journey's not gonna be pretty. Um, so let's honor each other, let's honor our feelings, and let's save as many people as we can while we're here. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. And for more refreshing stories about your community, click the subscribe button right over here. You can also download our Spectrum News app to get live news coverage, weather alerts, and more wherever you are. And don't forget to tune in to Channel 55 on DISH and DirecTV for live local reporting every single day. We'll see you then.